with getting that thing off. Above all, I did not want to have to empty out those gigantic fuel uh, tanks and uh, try again a different day. I believe that this nation should commit itself to achieving the goal before this decade is out of landing a man on the moon and returning him safely to the Earth. The final descent to the lunar surface was, uh, for me, the highlight of the flight. It's very challenging, uh, a lot of unknowns. Contact light. Okay, engine stop. Tranquility base here. The Eagle has landed. That's one small step for man. One giant leap for mankind. I think the important thing is that we learned that human beings can operate successfully on the surface of another planet. Uh, we don't have to stay here on Earth. We have a choice of where we want to go. I certainly felt that the American flag is what along there. It's characteristic of previous explorations to, uh, to plant a symbol uh, upon arriving at a new shore. I was impressed by the, the talcum powder nature of, of the fine surface itself. If you look at a boot print, it's just it's so smooth, uh, just like you just put the certain talcum powder. It appears from the moon uh, is a very uh, small and fragile object. And when you think about it, that's not an inaccurate description. Well, I enjoyed being in the command module by myself. It was a, a happy little home. Uh, all the machinery was working properly. Uh, and uh, my, my concerns uh, were not within the command module, but simply that something might go wrong with the uh, lamb with the lunar module, and these two guys might get stuck on the surface of the moon. That was my, my main thing. Go ahead. Uh, Roger, the uh, Hornet is uh, on station, uh, just far enough off the target point to uh, keep from getting hit. Recovery one. to the moon and this decay and do the other thing. Not because they are easy, but because they are hard. Because that goal will serve to organize and measure the best of our energies and skills.